Them city slicker government agents are always a-watching me. They're a-watching all of us. I seen them in town at the puppet show, at fancy shindigs, even when I'm out shopping for buckets. The beaver ran off with my old one. You know what you did. Oh, donkey spittle. I bet you there's even places I missed. Hmm, swap meets, music festivals, behind that tapestry at the Northwest Mansion, Globnar penny arcades, youth soccer games, uh, go-kart tracks. <laughs> Sometimes I stand on my head to get ideas a percolating up in my brain. <laughs> Creative juices. Yesterday, I was looking around, see, and I noticed a window in the mystery shack shaped like a triangle with a big old eyeball in it. Now I can't stop thinking about triangles. Portals, demons, nacho earrings, infinity pizza. I have a theory that roadside cones are trying to take over the world, trying to put squares and circles in their place. Lousy shapes. <laughs> Hooey! Howdy there! McGucket here! I seen so many gold medals here in Gravity Falls, I thought we was hosting some sports sing event! Is this making any sense to you? I think he's just crazy. But then I found out, no, those ain't for awards! What are you playing at, old man? They're for a secret society! Everyone's in on it! Old Stan Pines, Sheriff Blubs, that mini golf pro! I've seen this before! The guy at the carnival! I wish I could tell you more, but I can't! Oh my goodness, my tooth is gold! Wow! Maybe I'm one of them! Numbers are haunting my dreams. That number, 618! Yeah! It's everywhere. Have you seen it? It's a total mystery. At the mystery shack, in prison, at the cash register. But what does it mean? What does it mean? We need to find out what it is. I got to figure it. The only thing that makes sense. It's a clue from a creature in another dimension that we're all just drawings on a page. Everything is different now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, McGucket. You're losing it. Howdy, folks. <laughs> Old man McGucket here again with another one of my fantastic ideas. You know, I've seen this number on my computer box, but I couldn't tell you how it got there. Oh, I don't recall. Maybe it's a date or an old-timey phone number, but you know what I think? I bet it's the coordinate for the passage back to Possum Town. It's a real place. Or maybe it's just the number of hairs what's left on my beard. Let me count them. One, two, Jimmy, Steve. Where am I? Now, I don't get into that chit chat and scuttlebutt. That's for Toby to determine. Ugh, this guy. But there's been a lot of talk about who's relationshipping up with who. Mabel shipping off with a merman. Is it getting hot out here, or is it just that guy? Dipper and Pacifica. Ew. Me and my favorite raccoon. <laughs> get in there, raccoon. If you ask me, it's a bunch of hogwash. Although, have you ever been to an actual hogwash? <laughs> it's a fantastic time. Soaping down a pig is its own reward. <laughs> Cryptograms. Have you seen this mixed up gobbledygook? Ugh, oh, this again. I can read it, but I don't know what it means. Yuru, Zerksivy, Gersmatov. <laughs> I tried all sorts of languages. Ooh la la, wee wee. Western Yakima, Manitar, <laughs> Possum Sanskrit, you name it. And I can't make no sense of it. <laughs> I guess this one will go unsolved forever. <laughs> Oh well, time for my hootin' nanny. Eagle dang doom doom. <laughs> okay, I know who the pine tree is, and the star, and the glass as well. It's obviously me and my beautiful blue eyes. I'm not so sure about that. But I can't for the life of me figure out that ice bag. Maybe it's Willie Badger, since he's so cool. Who wants to get badgered? Or maybe it's that wax head. He's got to stay cool. Or that future guy. Uh, what's his name? Blendo Blar Blar. There it is. What? My TV's talking to me again. Now I got the chills. I tell you, there's something downright duplicitous about that guy Stan. I know I used to see a guy would look just like him around here. Reading books, being all sciencey and whatnot practically looked like Stan's twin brother. Who is that? Is this the part where one of us faints? <laughs> you know, I got a twin brother too. Real pesky feller. Stares at me in the wash tub. Well, joke's on him. I haven't taken a bath in weeks. <laughs> I smell real bad.